Hi kids! Today we will be learning adding and subtracting time duration. So let's get started. First of all, we should know that we write time as hours, minutes, seconds. Example, here it is 5 hours, 34 minutes and 10 seconds. Now we will learn how we can add time. We have to add 2 hours and 30 minutes to 5 hours and 20 minutes. While adding time, the simple rule is to add hours with hours and minutes with minutes. By adding hours, we get 7 hours. And by adding minutes, we get 50 minutes. So adding 2 hours, 30 minutes to 5 hours, 20 minutes, we get 7 hours and 50 minutes. That is, 7 hours and 50 minutes. Let's take another example. We have to add 5 hours, 10 minutes to 1 hour, 15 minutes. Adding hours, we get 6 hours. And adding minutes, we get 25 minutes. So, our answer is 6 hours, 25 minutes. Now, let's take another example. We have to add 3 hours, 40 minutes to 1 hour, 55 minutes. Adding hours, we get 3 plus 1 equals 4 hours. And adding minutes, we get 40 plus 55 equals 95 minutes. Here, the minutes are more than 60, and we know 60 minutes make an hour. So, subtract 60 from minutes and add 1 to hours. So, 95 minus 60 equals 35 minutes. And adding 1 to hours, we get 5 hours. So, our answer is 5 hours, 35 minutes. So we learned add hours to hours and minutes to minutes. But if minutes are more than 60, subtract 60 from minutes and 1 to hours. Now, let's take another example. We have to add 6 hours, 17 minutes to 3 hours, 45 minutes. Adding hours, we get 9 hours. And adding minutes, we get 62 minutes. Here, the minutes are more than 60. And we know 60 minutes make an hour. So add 1 to hours and subtract 60 from minutes. Subtracting 60 from minutes, we will be left with 2 minutes. And by adding 1 to hours, we get 10 hours. So, our answer is 10 hours and 2 minutes. Kids, now let's learn how we can subtract time. We have to subtract 5 hours, 20 minutes from 7 hours, 45 minutes. While subtracting time, the same rule is to be followed. Subtract hours from hours and minutes from minutes. Subtracting hours, that is, subtracting 5 hours from 7, we are left 2 hours. Now, subtract minutes from minutes. Subtracting 20 from 45 minutes, we are left with 25 minutes. So our answer is 2 hours, 25 minutes. Now let's take another example. We have to subtract 8 hours and 50 minutes from 10 hours and 55 minutes. Subtracting hours from hours, that is, subtracting 8 from 10, we are left with 2 hours. Subtracting minutes from minutes, that is, subtracting 50 minutes from 55 minutes, we are left with 5 minutes. So the answer is... 2 hours, 
five minutes. Now let's take another example. We have to subtract four hours, 40 minutes from five hours, 30 minutes. Now here is a tricky question. We have to subtract hours from hours. Subtracting four from five, we are left with one hour, but we have to subtract 40 minutes from 30 minutes. Now here's something to learn. If the minutes to be subtracted are more than minutes from which we have to subtract, add 60 minutes to the minutes from which we have to subtract and subtract one from hours. Add 60 to 30 and the minutes will become 90 and subtract one from hours. So the time duration will remain the same. It will be four hours and 90 minutes. Now you can subtract minutes from minutes. Now, subtracting hours we get four minus four equals zero hours. Now subtracting minutes, 90 minus 40 equals 50 minutes. Our answer is 50 minutes. Now let's take another example. We have to subtract 5 hours, 30 minutes from 7 hours and 20 minutes. While subtracting time, we have to subtract hours from hours and minutes from minutes. But here, we have to subtract 30 minutes from 20 minutes. So what we do in such cases is add 60 minutes to the minutes from which we have to subtract and subtract one from hours. That is, subtract one from seven. It will be six hours and add 60 minutes. It will be 80 minutes. So it won't change the time. It will be six hours and 80 minutes, which is same as seven hours and 20 minutes. But we can easily subtract five hours and 30 minutes from six hours and 80 minutes. Subtracting five hours from six hours, we get one hour. And subtracting 30 minutes from 80 minutes, we get 50 minutes. So our answer is one hour, 50 minutes. So kids, today we learned how we can add and subtract time durations. Okay kids, now you go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.